Ben is ready, stand by. He'll be up in a second. He's going to reveal his pairings in a moment. First though, Heather, uh, just recap the three brilliant stuffed mushroom recipes you prepared today. Okay, number one, we prepared a classic mushrooms Neptune, which is a crab and shrimp filling with cream cheese that we put into mushrooms. Uh, the second filling was a spinach and artichoke uh, mushroom filling that we put, it was uh, sour cream and cream cheese. That was so a little uh, mm. hint of red pepper flakes to give it a little bit of heat. And then the third recipe was a no-bake hummus stuffed mushroom that we uh, made the filling and then we piped it into uh, both cremini and white mushrooms and then we can make those ahead and store them in the fridge until we're ready to use them. Great job. The recipes for this show and the complete series of Great Tastes are available on the greattastesmb.ca website. Come with us now on a journey into the mind of Manitoba Liquor Mart product expert Ben Rush. You sure you want to go there? I do. I really do. <laughs> I want to know what you were thinking, what you were feeling, and where this all led. I was feeling pretty good when I was tasting those mushrooms. So they good. were brilliant. Loved it. And there's so many things you can do with mushrooms, right? And, and the subtle mm -hmm. flavors and everything, they just work so well together. So tasting these, I sat back and thought, geez, what would I really like to have with this if I were in a restaurant, for instance, or if I had you over and you were cooking these for us? And uh, so I picked a few wines that uh, I thought would uh, highlight the flavors and contrast with the kind of things that we're tasting. And we're dealing with uh, creaminess and some heat in some of them. And then we had the whole artichoke thing, which is, can be problematical, but worked brilliantly. Okay. Okay, so for the first one, the classic mushroom Neptune, yep. I chose the, uh, a wine from Tuscany. It's the Gabbiano Pinot Grigio. Pinot Grigio, uh, this particular one is imminently quaffable. It's, it's easy going, it's a nice palate cleanser, especially when you're dealing with the very subtle flavors of the crab and the shrimp, right? You don't want anything overpowering it, so you just want it to be um, a complementary thing. So a lighter dish with a lighter tasting wine that's got enough uh, crispness to refresh the palate when, when you're going through that kind of thing. For the next one, uh, I decided to go uh, with uh, Penfold's Bin 51 with the, uh, the spinach and artichoke mushroom thing. Now, the, the spinach and artichoke thing uh, had a little bit of heat, and artichokes, like I alluded to before, it's, incidentally, artichokes, uh, I was learning that it was, uh, it's a relative of the thistle family, which is really cool. I thought that was kind of neat. But anyway, uh, I decided to match it with uh, a wine that, uh, from a very famous winery, Penfolds. These guys are unbelievable. So this is from the Eden Valley High Altitude uh, Vineyard, and they've got a Riesling that works so well with it, it's just mind-blowing, it's so good. Well done. For the last one. I like that tidbit about the thistle, I'm not gonna lie as well. <laughs> that was good. For the no-bake hummus stuffed mushrooms, I decided to go with something a little more bold because there was oh, yeah. quite a bit of garlic in there, but I, I didn't choose a reserve Chianti. So I, I selected the Gabbiano Chianti, uh, again from Tuscany. The Sangiovese, the primary grape variety in that blend of wine, works very well with garlic, I find. And you know, Italy is kind of one of these gastronomic centers of the universe kind of thing. And, and garlic is no stranger to, to Tuscany. And I thought there's an instant connection there. They could be instant friends in the glass yeah. and on the palate. So I thought, you know what? Uh, with, the, with the little bit of uh, acidity that uh, the Sangiovese grape has, it'll be also a very, very good palate cleanser. So I thought there was just a three-way win. Well thought out. Good job, buddy. Tremendous show, Heather Dibert, Manitoba Mushroom Growers Association. Great work, thank, thank you. you. Thank you very much for watching. And Ben Rush, product expert, Manitoba Liquor Mart. Excellent work. Again, thanks so much for watching. These recipes are available. GreatTasteMB.ca. Manitoba Pork, here next week. Great Tastes of Manitoba is presented by Manitoba Liquor Mart. Great Tastes is brought to you by GreatTastesMB.ca. Great Taste is produced by Hummer Productions. <laughs>